Hello and um, welcome to this uh, PHP Sessions tutorial that I'll be making today. Uh, first let me just make this a little bit bigger so that you can read it. I hope this works. Um, so first I hope you know a bit about PHP already. Um, but basically what PHP Sessions do are is just um, they transfer information from page to page. Uh, so if you already know how variable works, then basically you will understand how this works. Um, so basically, let's just make an opening PHP tag and set something such as um, I'm just going to make a variable say a dollar sign uh, name, and let's say our name is Bob. So then that's a variable. Variable name equals Bob, and then um, we close PHP. So here I've just made a page called session test one PHP on my uh, local host. So I'm going to save that, and then um, if you just say now if I were just to go on another page which I just called session test two. Wait, delete that. That's nothing. Um, here, okay. So if I just called this session test two, and I said echo name. Um, it wouldn't echo, it would not output anything because here let's just go to localhost and then slash session test 2.php. It wouldn't output anything because according to this, <clears throat> name is actually not set to anything. It's, it's set to Bob on a different page, but information does not transfer by just using a variable. That's why we use sessions. So if I were to open session test, um, session test 1, and first what you have to do before anything when you want to use sessions is start the session. So you're just going to do session underscore start and then two parentheses and a semicolon. And remember that you must put session start before anything on the page. If you have an enter and then you start your PHP tag in session, then it won't work. You have to make sure that the P opening PHP tag that comes before your session start is not um, preceded by anything. So if I if I put like HTML here, and then I were to go to the page, uh, go to session oh, session test one, it would say it would have this you know crazy uh, error. So we're gonna go back and then get rid of that and make sure the PHP is at the very top. So we've started the session. Now what you have to do is set array variables or something, um, which actually works like this dollar sign underscore session in caps and then in brackets you do whatever so remember I named my variable name and then equals just one equal sign Bob okay so then if I were to save that and then go on a separate page which I named session test 2 and echo um, dollar sign session under you know underscore whatever and then name but then remember we have to start the session so session start oops and then semicolon and then save that and then we were to go to session test 2 we'll see if let's just look at session test 1 it's nothing there because all we did is set a variable so let's go to session test 2 and oh, look Bob so see basically what sessions do is it transfers information so you can use you can name a variable on one page and then echo the variable on a different page and it will remember it from the other page it's pretty nifty so yeah I'm kinda weird like that but yeah it's pretty cool and it's definitely very useful so hopefully this has helped you out and um, I hope to uh, inform you a little bit more I hope to have informed you a little bit more on PHP sessions. Thank you. Um, this has been a Blue Skies 94 tutorial.